Hello Pisces, welcome to the channel and this is going to be your weekly tarot reading April 30th to May 6th 2018. So the first card that shows up the topic for your week Pisces, this is going to be uh, the Ten of Swords. The second card shows up the core of the situation that is going to be the King of Wands. Third card does expresses the challenges that you need to overcome. This is going to be the Five of Pentacles. And the last one is the guidance here, Seven of Pentacles, which is what we do have. So another rough week for Pisces, for what it seems. I mean, um, as much as I want to sugarcoat it, uh, well, it's not going to be that bad, guys, because uh, <clears throat> the, Ten of the Ten of Swords and the King of Wands as a, a topic and the core of the situation points that you, there is someone above you, especially career-wise, that is seriously abusing their power upon you, okay? And they are seriously abusing the right, or not the right, but kind of like the ability to call the shots upon you. And this week it is where you will feel that pressure extensively. And um, don't be surprised if you go home, you know, for example, Tuesday or Wednesday, and you say, I'm sick of it, you know, I just don't want to deal with this anymore. So regardless of what this, the uh, <clears throat> circumstances or the consequences, excuse me, are going to be, I'm just going to go tomorrow and leave my job. I will give my resignation because I cannot endure that humiliation. Um, it may be as well humiliation, you know, anymore. And this is because this person's expectations and this person's demands as well are very high. And in many cases, guys, they are rather unreachable. No matter what you do, it is very unlikely to please them because they always ask for more. They do have these perfectionalized dreams or perfectionalized goals and how one needs to reach it and even if they contribute on their own they cannot even even they cannot fulfill their own personal expectations but unfortunately they uh, are doing very good job of making other people failing for their behalf so uh, in case you're finding yourself into a position that i have just explained it you know and you think that it is your fault it is not your fault guys it is just the uh, celluloid expectations of the person that stays above you into your career and basically even if they have hired the best <clears throat> specialists on this planet even the best specialists on that planet would have not been able to uh, fulfill as i said their demands and their expectations so the ten of swords as i said leads to a, a very radical decisions and actions that you are going to do with attempt to improve your circumstances but the guidance here is the seven of pentacles and the seven of pentacles points that you should not rush by any means but instead guys try to endure a little bit more because this card is a sign in guidance position is a sign that something very faithful is about to happen maybe not this week maybe it's going to be the next week but it will be exactly what you needed in order to as i said improve your circumstances so uh you should take it rather more easily this week and don't pay too much attention about the poignant statements that our people give you especially this person over here all right but instead know that you did the best you could and if someone um, have uh, different expectations, maybe they have to step in and show you how it's done. And I can guarantee you that if they step in and try to show you how it's done, they will do even even worse than you did, all right? And not that you have done worse, all right? But they will not be able to, um, to reach your level of expertise and to reach your level of performance here. And they will very well see that what they ask from you, it's, it's rather stupid. And same goes, goes for your relationship. Maybe your partner forget themselves into the comfort they are experiencing with you and they are start, you know, um, taking you for granted and abusing your kindness, etc., etc. And this has to stop. It has to be put to an end. So you need to be very drastic and radical here. You need to, if you have to, you should put an ultimatum upon them, you know, or you should storm your situation, show them that they can't cannot abuse your kindness etc etc and the challenges that you need to overcome here with the with the uh, five of pentacles is nothing but the sense that 
uh, you have a lot to lose if you go to this extreme standpoint. But in reality, that's not the case, all right? Because what could possibly be worse, right? <laughs> so uh, the, eight, the the five of pentacles, it is just the fear of being put into uh, out of the comfort zone. But you need to recognize here, Pisces, that the zone you are finding yourself at with this person is far from a zone of comfort. It is a zone, the way I see it here among the cards, it is a zone of torment and the zone, the zone of discomfort or rather like the zone of newness, it's much, um, it's much better than, than enduring, you know, um, <clears throat> enduring what they are doing to you right now but the thing is as we said with the seven of pentacles you have to be rather smart all right wait for the right moment wait for the right uh, for the right place in order to do so and just when the time comes what you do here totally destroy their expectations their um imagination as well you know and their um believe that they can do with you whatever they please to. So uh, that was your tarot reading Pisces for the upcoming week and I hope you guys enjoyed it and you liked it. And in case you're interested in a private reading with me, everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rod signing out now. See you next time. Bye.